wondering how the Las Vegas real estate market is doing for February 2019? Well, that's what we're talking about today, and we're starting right now. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Angela O'Hare, a realtor here in Las Vegas, Nevada, with the O'Hare team at Urban Nest Realty. If this is your first time here, consider subscribing by clicking that button down below and even that little bell for notifications because I talk about all kinds of cool stuff Las Vegas related and you don't want to miss out. Welcome to the February issue of my monthly minute market update for Southern Nevada. Today I will be going over January 2019 numbers. Las Vegas house price reached their highest level in months in January as sales plunged from a year ago and inventory nearly doubled. The medium sales price of single family homes last month was 300,000. The last time it reached that level was back in September 2018, which was up 1.6% from December 2018 and up 13.2% .2 year over year. Southern Nevada had a total of 3,805 new listings for the month of January, down 62.9% from December and up 22.7% from the prior year. There are also a total number of 7,254 single family houses listed without offers in January, up 9.7% from December and up 95.1% from the prior year. So what does that mean? That means that there are a lot of homes for sale on the market right now that are not getting sold. Currently, we have a four month housing supply in Southern Nevada up 28.8% from December and up 142% from prior year. 48.3% of closings for the month of January was on the market 30 days or less. In my opinion, the reason a lot of these homes are not selling is because the listing agents are really not doing their jobs. Most of the photos are taken by their cell phones and that really does not depict what the house really looks like. Most of these listing agents are truly not marketing the house effectively. Please watch my other video, Why Isn't My House Selling, to get a clear idea as to exactly what I'm talking about. The numbers show that the Las Vegas housing market started 2019 where it ended last year, amid rising prices, falling sales, and a swelling inventory. In previous years, prices and sales tend to tumble in January, which was traditionally the slowest months in the local housing market. As previously stated in many of my other Minute Market updates, houses have been staying on the market a lot longer. And as a buyer, you may be able to negotiate down on asking price or ask the seller to pay for your closing costs. We've been showing a lot of houses lately and I've noticed it's actually starting to pick up. Homes are finally starting to sell and as a buyer, you shouldn't wait much longer. With interest rates still relatively low, why not take advantage of this? Now, more than ever is a great time to buy, especially before the spring and summer buying frenzy begins. If you would like to download the full report provided by the Greater Las Vegas Association of Realtors, I provided a link down in the description below. I hope you've enjoyed my monthly minute market update for February 2019. I'm Angela O'Hare, a realtor here in Las Vegas, Nevada with the O'Hare team at Urban Nest Realty, and I'm here to answer all your real estate questions. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you on the next one. The medium sales price of single family homes last month was 300. Ozzy, close the door. My doggy wants to say hi. Hi, come here. Wanna come say hi to mommy? Come here. Come here, buddy. Come here, come here, come here. Come here. Hi, you're a good boy. There's my fat boy. This is Ozzy. Yeah, hello, you good boy. Hi, right, buddy. Mommy's trying to record a video. You gotta be a good boy. Oh, I love you. Yes, I do. I love you so much. Oh, yes. Okay, say bye bye.